This is Gerald, Johan van Baas and the educational channel of demonstrations that can show how letter combinations also direct you into a process of formation, a process of directions. Let's uh, go to the word lift. The lift uh, has uh, four different letters. These four letters direct you also into a certain specific direction. The L itself is always an enlargement, uh, just as you go from one to two points or from one to two dimensions, it will take a shape, a form. That's how it, go it goes every time when there is an L involved. The E is like an impulse to change, so you have a question mark where you need to change and then you have, of course, the change itself where it is possible. There you can find the E. The F are all kinds of different possible directions of which you, of course, can make a choice. Which direction? All, all directions at once it will go. All the directions should be possible at all times. The T is a distinctive difference. The underlying structure, why each letter has a specific meaning, is numerological, is an association based upon how numbers behave. And this is behaviorism, is the behaviorism of letters as well. And that's why they are also directions into a certain, uh, into certain positions, into certain uh, shaping of forms, directing you into certain um, positions. The li seems to lift indeed something up. You go to an enlargement and this enlargement is, has an insertion. This insertion goes into a larger an enlargement. It, it's as if it's taking up. But the lift go lift you to whatever position it is. Because of the F it can go any direction so this lifting is not upwards, but it's going from whatever position and to all positions. So while lift with the E in this just seems to be going into one direction of growth, let's say the F will show also that the lifting itself can be from anywhere and to anywhere. And that's what the word is expressing. It's not expressing the left from up from down to up it's go it's just pulling it into a, a changed position an enlarged position it it is uh, uh, if you also only take the frame of uh, the starting position it's an, an enlarged area where that can be reached and uh, the reaching point from where it is pulled, let's say, can be from anywhere or towards anywhere. So the lifting is not uh, is changing the position, but it can be a changing position to anywhere. In that way, it's still up, but uh, that's uh, that's only because it is an, an enlargement in an upper position, just like the E is going up or down uh, as. Uh, of course, you can always direct the E in those directions. I hope these were clear how the word lift and lifting is uh, expressed and what it means as a letter combination. Anyhow, this was another demonstration of the theory sounding form, also in theory uh, separated as a book in the development of the word. And you can check the website for the list of words that I have expressed and demonstrated before.